What is up everybody, Gary here back with another video. Today we are talking about Wi-Fi cards. Yes, that is right, Wi-Fi cards. That very essential piece of tech inside of your computer that makes internet possible. So getting into why I needed a Wi-Fi card, when I started this YouTube space, you know, being a photographer, doing weddings and portrait photography and all of that stuff, I have to do editing and then I also have to do the process of uploading my information to the internet to send to the client or send to the studio. So having Wi-Fi is a very big factor of my photography career and recently, getting into YouTube and getting into video, it's very important to actually have a good Wi-Fi card. So my router in perspective is actually about 50 feet away from my computer. So that's a very big issue. What I decided to do initially is buy a Wi-Fi range extender. For all those that are going to be asking me, hey Gary, what's a Wi-Fi range extender? So a Wi-Fi range extender is a piece of tech that you put in between where your router is and where your computer is and you put it right in between. So it takes, like the name suggests, takes the signal from the router, brings it halfway closer to your computer so that then you're able to use the speed of the internet a little bit faster or in general to be able to connect to it if you're otherwise not able to. So wanting to get a Wi-Fi range extender, I went, you know, grabbed my car keys, went to the store. Yes, I went outside, all social distancing and all of that good stuff. So I got to the store. We did a very nice and sterile QR code sign in went back into my car, waited for my turn, was picked, went up to the line. They asked for my name. They gave me some nice and good juicy hand sanitizer, sanitized my hands nice and dandy. And so I went into the store, I went into the store and now I'm looking for the Wi-Fi range extender. I'm looking at different price ranges. So for the purpose of just trying it out, I ended up buying a cheaper one, which is this TP-Link 300 megabit per second Wi-Fi. And so I ended up keeping this for a separate reason. Going the route of Wi-Fi range extending is good, but it also gets a pretty pricey for what I needed it for it didn't really get the job done looking through the store being a tech geek I actually just looked through the things that had the most speed and could give me the most internet output and the biggest range so what I came across is actually pretty funny I came across a Wi-Fi card so a Wi-Fi card for all those that don't know is a card that is inside your desktop computer and also laptops but in desktops you're actually able to remove the Wi-Fi card and put in a better one if you want to so I picked the item up from the shelf and I thought to myself you know what let's try it out 69 dollars I think is what it cost and it was well worth it because some of the really high-end range extenders actually offered less speed and cost about $150 so I thought to myself you know what this is cheaper and I'm getting more speed yes this includes a little bit of a modding but I'm not gonna lie it's actually pretty fun to mod your own computer well at least to me it is so I thought to myself why not and this is how I came to this item which I'm really happy I ended up purchasing and that being the Asus AX3000 so the Asus AX3000 is a Wi-Fi card and it comes with two antennas all you have to do is open up your desktop, which should be fairly easy. Remove your old Wi-Fi card, put in the new Wi-Fi card, put in the antennas. But let me tell you what I love about this Wi-Fi card and why I would suggest it to you. Asus actually just released this item. This is the Asus AX58BT LAN card, which is tremendously fast. What this comes with in the box is the antenna base with two detachable antennas. You got the motherboard USB cable. You have the low profile bracket. You have the support CD, the warranty card, the quick start guide, and the hotline card. So all of those come into this really nice package. So why I believe this Wi-Fi card is crucially important to photographers and videographers and people that do streaming or uploading of any sort. First of all, the range on this thing is phenomenal. The range on this is tremendous. This gives me at least six times more range. There's another factor why I really, really love this Wi-Fi card. This might be the main reason opposed to the reason of the range, which is also very important to me. So this Wi-Fi card is 2.7 times faster the average Wi-Fi card. That being said, that's actually limited to the internet speed you're paying for and the amount of speed that your internet service provider is actually giving you. So like I said earlier, this is a cheaper route than buying a Wi-Fi extender, which is great because you're going to be keeping this on your computer. This is not going to be siphoning any extra electricity. There's no extra setup required, no apps, nothing. All you have to do is take out the old Wi-Fi card, put in the new one, install the drivers, and you're ready to go straight out the box. This Wi-Fi card actually actually utilizes the new Wi-Fi 6 technology, which is a step forward from the Wi-Fi 5 that we previously had. This Wi-Fi card actually provides, like I said, 2.7 times faster speeds than the previous generation Wi-Fi cards, which is mind blowing and is tremendous, especially for our time of streaming and photography and videography and all of that stuff. It is very essential that you be able to have a reliable, fast 
with connection nowadays. So another bonus to this card is that you get Bluetooth 5.0 capability. Yes, that's right. If you previously did not have Bluetooth on your computer, you will now have the ability to connect wireless speakers, do wireless transfers with your phones, all of that good stuff. Being able to further utilize pieces of technology that you already have around you. Next, we have the security features of this Wi-Fi card, which is WPA3. WPA3 is a new standard of security that's being released with Wi-Fi cards, which is tremendous. And it's really good for plenty of reasons, like not getting your password hacked and not getting your information stolen. So WPA3, way to go. So lastly, what's really nice about this Wi-Fi card is it comes with external antennas that can further boost your range. It gives you about two feet worth of range where you can move it from side to side. Yes, you could take those antennas and mount them directly to the Wi-Fi card. This external antenna base is actually really good for adding that extra foot of range where that could mean anywhere from five to 10 extra megabytes per second to your speed, which is great. Why not utilize that? And the best part is you could actually magnetize that straight to the case of your desktop. Nothing else, nothing else needed. All right, guys, so we're gonna end off here. If you like this video, please leave a thumbs up. That would do tremendous things for my channel. I really appreciate it. If you have any comments, please leave them down below. Please let me know if you're going to go with this Wi-Fi card or if you're going to be purchasing a different one and let me know why. If you enjoyed this video and you'd like to see more like this, please hit the subscribe button and hit that little notification button to be able to see the next time I upload a video. All right, guys, so this was Gary and I will see you in the next video. Peace. <laughs> yeah, hey, <laughs> yeah, yes, that is what we're doing today, sonny boy. <laughs> yeah, okay. Is that on? It's on. Hey, <clears throat> um, I just want to take my water bottle. I want to drink it. Yes.